Hello, my name is Cynthia Cantorero, and I am a senior class of 2021 at Taiyi High School, and I am a senior of UB. And today I'd like to talk to you guys about how I wish I took my freshman year, like I took it seriously instead of taking it for granted, because now as a senior, I am currently not struggling because my grades are good, but to get my GPA up to what I want it to be. And um, I'll just start off with like my background of like, how my grades were and then I can talk to you guys about like what I wish I would have done and everything and advice so I went to Highline my first semester of my freshman year because I thought it was a good idea especially because of soccer because I play soccer and make the team is better so it was a mistake and I ended that semester with 40 1b and 1a and me, I'm like, oh, it's my freshman year, you know, I don't care. Like, I was thinking, like, I'm super cool and all that. But then my mom got, like, dis she's not disappointed in me, but because of something, I had to move to Taiyi. So I moved back, and, like, same thing, about two months passed, and I'm just like, oh, it's whatever. And then something happened in my family where my, one of my parents were detained. Well, both of my parents were detained by immigration, but luckily they let my mom go. And then my dad was taken into a detention center in Tequila. I mean, to Tequila and then Tacoma, sorry. And so my grades weren't bad, but then it was just super stressful not having your parent there and just thinking like for the worst. And I ended that semester with five C's and a B. And yes, it's bad, but I was super stressed and I just didn't know what to do anymore. So then we'll move on to my sophomore year. And my sophomore year first semester, it's not the best, but it was better. And I had two A's three B's and two C's. My GPA started going up and obviously it didn't go up by much because of how bad it was my freshman year. And then we'll go to my second semester and I ended with two A's, four B's and a D. <sighs> Same thing, chemistry, I didn't care. I just thought I was the cool kid. And then I realized that my junior year is coming and I need to start taking school super seriously, which I wish I would have done my freshman year. So then we'll move on to my junior year this year. And I took, my freshman year I took the language test. So I was already, I didn't have to take an art class anymore and I was already ahead on my credit. So I believe I started, I, I got three out of four. So then let's go to my junior year. My junior year I ended first semester with three A's, a B and two C's. Not bad, but of course, could have been a lot better. Then we'll move on to my second semester. And I ended this past semester, my junior year, with four A's and two B's. Luckily, my GPA went up, but it's not where I want it to be. So I just wanted to talk to you guys about how I personally wished I would have got my GPA up from the beginning. Because I'm currently at a 2.82. It's not good if you think about it and I have to work myself super hard this senior year to get this GPA up but luckily because I did pass my classes the grades weren't good but I passed my classes I only have 1.5 credits to worry about next year so that's a year of, of English and then half a year of half, one semester of art so I'll be doing running start this year to be ahead and hopefully get my GPA up and everything and be better. But thankfully, my junior year ended a month past and two years and four months later, my dad got out of the detention center. Two years and four months. Now I'm thankful that I took school a lot more seriously and I have the support from my dad now. So I just it just made me realize that I have to do everything I can to make him proud, especially for everything he sacrificed for me. So thank you.